You doing, sir? How's it going? Good. It's, it's no Fury professional grappling, but how does it feel to be, uh, <laughs> you know, on a UFC fight week here? Feels good. It's definitely a dream come true. Uh, great opportunity. I mean, I put a lot of time into this sport. I put a lot of time into wrestling and, and MMA, so I'm slowly getting there, you know, slowly starting to get closer to the dream, to the goal. When did you get the call to find out that you were going to be on this card? I think it was 10 or 11 days before Saturday. So it was like 10 or 11 days out. Yeah, I was in uh, I was in Acme. It's like a random number from Texas. And I'm like, usually I would never answer it. I'd be like, oh, this is definitely spam. And uh, I don't know. For some reason I had like, I should answer this phone call. And I call, he's like, hey, it's Mick Maynard. Uh, just want to know if you can make weight next week. And I'm like, yeah, of course. And he's like, all right, I'll be in touch. I hang up. And then I'm like walking through the aisle like, that was definitely a prank phone call. Like, <laughs> like, there's no way. And I'm like, why is he calling me, not my manager? And then I call my manager. He's like, yeah, 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 it's real. And I was like, awesome. That's yeah. great. So, did, so, I mean, was there any, like, well, who's the opponent or what are we facing? Was I there mean, any at talk that of that? It didn't matter, to be honest. I was, so, um, I, at that point, I didn't know that uh, Treshawn was out. So, um, you know, they, they I was kind of like, is it Urbina? It, I didn't expect Mike, to be honest, but, uh, I mean, I would have loved the rematch, obviously. I would have loved another chance at the finale. Um, I think everyone saw how that first round went. Um, but, I mean, I'm happy, man. I got, I'm getting another opportunity. So, you know, I can't complain. No doubt. So before getting this other opportunity, how would you have described your time on the show? Like when you walked away, were you frustrated or bitter or anything like that? So I was kind of under the impression that, um, that they were going to have a card around all the, the tough – um, contestants and the coaches, obviously. And then I saw that they announced uh, Ortega and Volkanovski were in September on the pay-per-view card. And I was like, oh, that's weird. That And I kind of figured that that meant that they weren't going to fight on the same card as us. And then when I saw the finale and, um, you know, I was just kind of under the impression that I was going to be on the finale and I saw the finale and it had 14 fights on it. And I was like, oh, man, that's not good. You know, I had a bad feeling. And I, I really was excited because I had two, two teammates on the same card, Pat Sabatini and Sean Brady. So, um, yeah, I was kind of like, oh, man, that sucks. That would have been a great opportunity. And then I got the call. Yeah. That's awesome. So how much were you training? I mean, were you training as if there was going to be a fight for you this week? Or, or did you not because you didn't have the call? Um, I'm always in the gym. Like, if I miss – Two days, my coach is up my ass. So I'm always in the gym for sure. I just, I mean, I just probably didn't do as much like little glove sparring as, as I would normally do. But um, I, we're always ready. We're always training. Yeah. That's awesome. What do you think about the matchup stylistically? Uh, I mean, what's not to love, you know? Um, besides the obvious of like, you know, he has, he's been beat, he's been submitted three or four times. I think it was three times. And I mean, I submit majority of my opponents I mean that's a huge you know huge factor uh I, it's rare that I get to fight a guy that's shorter than me for sure you know especially at 85 I, I mean what's not the love about the matchup for sure All right last thing for me I guess what's the goal here man is it just go just go get a win and secure your place in the UFC or is it like go do something spectacular and make people go you know that that's the guy we got to pay attention to what, what is what's the goal? look I'm not doing to do uh I'm not going out there to do backflips and stuff but I'm here to make a statement for sure uh, I'm I'm here to make a statement that says look I'm here I'm here to stay I'm dangerous for anyone I fight and, and uh, I'm, I'm the best in the world at what I do for sure I've asked all the guys so far um today about their time on tough and things that didn't air some fun stories uh, we've heard some crazy stuff already. I'm curious if you have any stories you want to share with us. That's like the golden question today, or at least this week. Um, yeah, I mean, there was a lot, a lot of great moments in the house, especially that like didn't make the show, you know, for whatever the format is. But uh, it's funny, like the first before my quarterfinal, there was like this bird stuck in our house, and uh, I like got the pool net out and like caught the bird and released it, and it was like in in the middle of like a really boring day. It was like eventful. Does, it probably doesn't sound that much. So I go out and win the quarterfinal. And then uh, right before my semifinal, we were like sitting, we were all sitting by the pool. And there was this bird just like acting weird again. And someone said like, hey, look at that bird. Next thing you know, the bird jumps in the water. And uh, we're like, that's weird. Drowns itself in the, in the pool. So we, I, I pull it out. We got nothing else to do. I pull the bird out and we start trying to give it like, you know, the chest <laughs> compressions. <laughs> 
Long story short, we don't save the bird. The bird dies. We have like a proper burial for it and everything. <laughs> and I was like, I remember going back and inside, be like, that cannot be a good sign for like what today's gonna happen. But uh, it is what it is. Yeah. That's definitely not the Fucking kind of story bird. I expected. <laughs> Thank you. 